the bottom navigation bar. At the start, we will create a current index that we will set as zero. And we will create a list of widget, which we will call body. This will be a list of multiple icon, the home, the menu, and the person. This will be used in the body of the scaffold. So let's do this right now. In the scaffold, we have the body. We will create a center widget. Inside, we have the child, which is the body. We will show the icon of the current index. Now it's time to create the bottom navigation bar widget. This one will require the current index. We have created this variable earlier. When we press on an icon from the bottom navigation bar, this is what will happen. We will have the information of the new index. We will set state, and then we will say that the current index is equal to the new index that we have received from the untap. The items from the bottom navigation bar will be a list of bottom navigation bar item. You need to create a label. For this one, we will say home. We will create two other bottom navigation bar item, this one with the menu and this one with the profile. And with all this, you can see that you have a bottom navigation bar with Flutter. And every time you change the icon, the icon in the body will change also.